North India is in the grip of severe cold wave. With the minimum temperature falling below 2 degree, dense fog crippled road and rail movement. Flights are no exception as well. On Monday, five flights were diverted from Delhi to Jaipur due to poor weather conditions. Delhi Airport tweeted that flight operations may be impacted due to fog. But how do pilots land in inclement weather conditions like dense fog? Let's find out. First, if the visibility at airport falls below 600 meters due to fog, the airports activate low visibility procedures or LVPs. The Delhi airport has already activated it. Under this, the air traffic control and pilots use map and visual communication to maneuver aircraft on the taxiway. The queuing of aircraft on the runway is disallowed to prevent possible accidents. It is the main reason that leads to delay in flights. Secondly, the airports use a high-level instrument landing system or ILS, an anti-fog technology that helps the planes land using radio signals and high-intensity lighting arrays. It uses two radio beams together which provide pilots with both vertical and horizontal guidance during an approach to land. There are several categories of ILS. Category 1 ILS is suitable for landing where the visibility is greater than 800 meters. Category 2 for visibility greater than 300 meters. And Category 3 is suitable if the visibility is below 300 meters. Category 3 further has three subcategories A, B and C. In India, major airports use the Category 3B system, suitable for visibility from 50 meters to 200 meters. The system's voice prompts the pilot when they need to deploy the flaps and subsequently when it needs to apply the brakes. It is a very advanced technology, but not many airports have deployed it and few pilots are trained to handle it. Owing to its high installation and maintenance cost, only six airports in India Delhi, Amritsar, Jaipur, Lucknow, Bangalore and Kolkata are equipped with Category 3B ILS. A report quoted the former chairman of Airport Authority of India, VP Agarwal, saying the initial cost of this goes up to 10 crore rupees and the recurring maintenance cost can reach around 50 lakh rupees a month. On top of that, only a handful of airlines including Indigo, Vistara, Jet Airways and Air India Express have pilots that are trained to use Category 3B ILS. The reason for this too is the cost. It costs an airline up to 10 lakh rupees to train one pilot to use the system. Internationally, Category 3C ILS is widely used for precision landing as it can land the aircraft in zero visibility. New York, London, Hong Kong and Paris are equipped with this technology. If you like this video, share it and subscribe to Business Standard. For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram and LinkedIn.